Well, good morning, Crossing Church. Happy Thursday to you. Hope your week's going really well as you're jumping into our finest hour and you're kind of walking through this guide. If you haven't had a chance to see this yet, maybe because this video has been shared with you by a friend, family member, or coworker. Over the last couple of weeks, we've been working through this daily guide. And one of the things we've been doing on Thursday is we've been looking at that specific day in the guide. And we've been taking that verse and we've been saying, all right, how can we take that verse in the guide and then let it to be a way for us to pray? So here's week three day number four here's what it says sovereign lord you are god your covenant is trustworthy and you have promised these good things to your servant second samuel 7 28 and so what i want to do is just show real quick hey, how can we take this verse and start to turn it into a prayer rather than the like god help me with this or god could you do that and just feeling like we're moving on here's a way that we can actually start a dialogue where we could hear back from god and so here's just one thing you do like sovereign lord like you are god this is even a space right now for you to be able to express your own thanks to god to be able to say how much you love god or the way that god has changed your life like his influence over you you can say your covenant is trustworthy like all the things that god has promised to you he means it he's not a liar he's not deceptive he's not tricking you but god is trustworthy in all of his promises and you have promised these good things to your servants so even just to think over moments in your life or areas of your life where maybe you're walking through a fire right now as andrew would describe this weekend and maybe you're having this moment where you're saying i don't know like it feels in this like really uncertain way this is a moment for you you could say you have promised these good things to your servant and for you to be able to say like god you made a promise on this and i'm going to believe it today no matter what my circumstances say so even right now just taking a little space where you could say to god man you promised this to me I believe you about this. You can even put it in the comments right now if you want. If there's something you're praying about right now and you may be losing faith or maybe you want other people to jump into prayer with you, go ahead and post it in the comments. I'll join with you. Our prayer team will join with you. And here's the thing that's going to happen tonight. Tonight at 7 p.m., we're going to post the link to it in the comments as well. You can join me as well as some other people. We're just going to put this into practice. We're going to take the other days of our daily guide and we're going to say we're going to take some time where we pray together. So I want to encourage you, whether you've uh, been praying your entire life and you feel like you've got it down pat, or you feel like you've never said a prayer out loud. That happened last week. Somebody prayed out loud for the very first time. I'd love for you to join me. We'll see you tonight, 7 p.m. Link in the comments. We'll see you there.